Hi, Prosperity Team, it's Dr. Mani coming to you from the Prosperity Corner of the Universe where silliness is sacred and nobody's perfect. I am your P.O.P., your Professor of Prosperity, and I'm here so that all of our lives can pop with prosperity. I have this wonderful little rock that someone gave me. You can see that it has the word harmony printed on it. Now it's a pretty good size rock and it's cool to touch and I keep it in bed with me. And when I wake up in the middle of the night and I'm really hot, I can rub this rock on me. Yet I'm also familiar with the idea of writing things on a glass of water or having the words written on something and really being able to experience the energy of it, that, um, that, that harmony. Um, of course, I could contemplate on this. I could, I could um, do a lot of things with the word harmony, but when I've got this rock, it's something very tangible for me to focus on. And I thought, you know, it would be really great if I had a rock that had prosperity engraved in it, on it, or abundance. And that was on Friday. I just put it out of my mind and I thought that it would be cool. We picked up our grandchildren on Saturday morning and we took them to the park. And on this, at this particular park, it's under a, a large bridge and there's a gift shop there and a little cafe. And we went in and the boys were looking at things and lo and behold, what do I find but a bin full of rocks that have uh, words that are etched on them or engraved on them. And I looked and I thought, well, I wonder if there's one that has either prosperity or abundance carved on it. Look what I got, prosperity. Look what else I got. Abundance. There was one, one with prosperity and one with abundance in it. And I was just elated. I thought, so now I've got my three rocks that have something on it. I was excited because I had just been thinking the day before that I'd like to have rocks with this engraved in it. And where in the world would you ever, you know, go for that? It was not like I would go on a hunting trip to try to find that, but it just so happens we went to one park, boys didn't like it, it was very crowded. And so we decided to go to another park and this was the park that had the rocks. I love this, it seems magical to me. It seems uh, not totally surprising because uh, I had thought of it, it manifested, that shouldn't be so strange. We know that thoughts attract things into our lives, but yet every time it happens for me, it's awesome, it's magical. And I don't wanna lose that sense of wonder about life. And I don't think we wanna lo lose that sense of wonder. We can go, oh, ho, oh, hum, another miracle. Oh, ho, oh, hum, another manifestation. It should be, yes, isn't this absolutely wonderful? Because this kind of energy, this all energy, this is a flowing energy. And we all know that not only do we wanna go with the flow, we wanna be the flow. We want to be the flow. So let's join in the flow by breathing in and receiving our good. Remember, getting and receiving are not the same. Receiving is being a part of the flow of our good coming into our lives. And so we breathe that in. And as we exhale, we exhale our intention that all other beings receive their good as well. And this is Dr. Money. And I want you to remember one more thing for sure. And that is, that I love you.